to the like the hot topics currently uh starting with first one is uh, vaccine in children i mean i heard about lot of news that uh since if children will get vaccinated the spread can be controlled or is it a myth or what are the facts about about vaccination for children so vaccination sorry i couldn't hear you disha can you just uh, repeat that sorry. vaccination yeah a uh, vaccination for children a uh, yeah. lot of myths are going around so what is your suggestions or what is your take on that okay so unfortunately in uh, vaccination in children is not it been rolled out especially in, we we don't have it in tamil nadu as well like you know we're just looking at probably uh, by the end of september maybe or mid september we would like to get vaccines but uh, what we have to remember is like you know okay. uh, vaccination has been an in and out uh, Uh, in our profession every day like you know every day in our profession we do in and out vaccinations uh, for children and uh, the wonderful thing i've noticed is very less percentage came and asked me during the clinic okay madam what vaccine are you giving and what problems it causes but uh, because uh, covid 19 has become so sensational in social media now all of them are questioning about like you know vaccine when swine flu vaccine came no one questioned you know what kind what brand how much ml you will give what are the side effects none of them question and if flu yeah. boosters are given flu boosters i advocate personally to pediatric patients like you know if they are afford to definitely please do every year until at least they are 5 to 7 year old you can do flu vaccines and uh, we did during that time also because of flu vaccines we get fever and uh, the common side effects like you know we'll see body pains uh, actually this is the response of uh, uh, the body responds to the vaccine so that means it's a good sign if patients are getting fever if they have a bit of swelling or if they have a body pain it's a good sign it is showing that the vaccine is working and patients are like you know developing immunity to it so we are going to develop antibodies but now when covid has come and when they're saying like you know we found vaccines then people are really worried like you know is it going to cause a big problem because uh, i think one of the things that came across through the world is like you know the fear about vaccines and the different vaccines especially we had to rush the vaccine production in a short time yeah like you know all of us were worried in fact our health professionals at the start we were worried and we were personally like you know should we take they i've seen many of my uh, colleagues who were not willing initially but then now i think it is time uh, majority of us if you see like you know we we were at the start all the doctors have got and we volunteered and all the health professionals and doctors got initially and uh, through my circle i've seen like you know so many thousands of uh, people getting vaccine they're all fine so you have to take an example of how many people are getting problems and how many do you personally know who've called you up and told like you know yeah we've got problems i would be you know there are a couple of vaccines in india that have been approved and they'll be out soon but if we have one like you know we should go ahead and give our children and uh, because that is the only way we can now prevent uh, the large scale of uh, like you know the super spread in, that is happening with covid 19 so that is the only way we can prevent yeah. as long as we vaccinate everyone so i my end point is about vaccinations is please don't become paranoid and like you know about uh, like you know which brand or which one yes you should work out like you know what is the percentage and how much uh, uh, what is the efficacy yeah, of the vaccine but uh, by now uh, like you know by in large now you have a proof that you know in the second wave especially that uh, people who have vaccinated with the first in the first round where yeah even though they had there are some people who had an infection with covid even after vaccine but they were only mildly they came up with only with mild symptoms so. yeah so you see the majority of uh, patients who became very very sick are the people who did not get vaccinated and uh, sadly even among health professionals uh, we have had incidents uh, majority of them if you look at the end of the day it was like you know uh, like you know the doctors or other health professionals uh, the who had very serious illness were like you know who did not receive vaccines uh, or they had only like you know first set of vaccine and they still were in june for a second set of vaccine actually so second dose of vaccine i mean
so that is a good example to say that you know so you should we should go ahead and get our children vaccinated as soon as uh, the vaccines are available uh, throughout india